Dio Gelder arrived at Sunderland as a deadline day signing from Leeds United and went straight into the matchday squad for his debut only four days later. Only 20 years old, Yelder has played at every age level for Norway. Primarily a centre-half, he's happy to play anywhere along the back line, and against Middlesbrough, he was deployed for his debut behind Jack Clark as a left-back. So, let's have a look at Leo Yelder and all his touches. A game that means an awful lot to both sets of fans here. Beats. He scored in the reverse fixture, a 4-0 win for Middlesbrough away at Sunderland. Takes the low route instead. And a foul given away by an overly enthusiastic Leo Hjelda. Signed for one and a half million pounds from Leeds United on the 30th of January, the Norway under-21. Ailing, looking for Hackney, who's won six but also lost six here in front of his own fans. Fours, pushing 0-9 in the back. Not really sure why Fours is getting involved there. Oh, and keeping his cool, openings at both ends. Sunderland sending players forward here. But Equa in support. Back it comes instead, though. Fired in with pace there by Trey Hume. And a counter through Hackney. In the last couple of years, who've provided plenty. Ross Stewart has had his injury issues. And of course, no longer at the club either. Now a Southampton player. Kielder. Somehow sends it all the way over to the opposite. The winning goal in a 1-0 win for Sunderland here in the 96-97 season and a 2-0 win in 2005-06 as Tommy Miller and Julio Arca scored. Hangs it high, the referee was in the way there of Lucas Engel who still goes for goal. Hand up in apology from the official. Yelda losing out. Azaz. Oh, it's a nice ball. It's going to come here to Greenwood. No. Taken away from him by Hume. Sign from Leeds, creeping forward with the ball. Claims of handball there against Yelda. Still a chance here for the Borough, and away by Equa. Was it handball earlier? Top of the arm. If even that, maybe off the chest, but you're not going to get penalised for that. Not with the T-shirt line, as it's. Of nervy moments though for Hjelda. The books of Charlton and FC20 as a youth, he retired at the age of 21, but Harrick, of course, had a notable top flight career. Here's Hackney. Bellingham on that occasion walking into traffic, didn't know what was around him. Hackney didn't catch it cleanly, always swing away from goal. Racing away to the right, there he is, giving the ball away. Kielde. That's better. Hackney and Greenwood could be on to this. Patterson there first, and Patterson. Patterson had to get rid quickly. Kielder claims of handball. 
Scored 10 in 25 for Chelsea's under-21 side last season. He actually appeared for them right at the start of this camp. Balassa. Azaz, lovely control. Hackney's ball gets there. He's ailing. Fours. In towards Hackney. Firm challenge, Hackney. Actually, no, not. Another free kick for some. Engel to his left. Azaz does it himself, and Hackney coming in. Years now. Kielder into Clark. Kielder. Back to him. Loves the charge forward, Luke Ayling. Fours. Ayling could score. Couldn't quite. A nine to Kielder. Greenwood. Touch too long there for Force. Hilda dealt with it well. Housen to Ailing. Stopped there by Hilda. Clark. Dazzling footwork from him again. The best carrier of the ball in the. De oh, nine. Hilda. though to Ailing. Of course, wasn't expecting a ball like that. That's been in good form recently, but hasn't been involved too much today. He might be here though. 23. Forward it goes. Doesn't quite roll for fours now as well. Joining Jones, Latte Lat, Greenwood and Coburn. And they've made their advantage at the top of this second half count with a goal. High, looking for fours. Kielder managing to set Tony Mowbray just before Christmas. Azaz, challenged by 09, away by Kielder. Bouncing off of November. We understand Rusin is imminent. Well, in 29 championship games, Sunderland's starting striker have had just seven shots on target between them. It's a pitiful run. To make do with appearances off the bench since then. The man signed from Benfica. Lovely touch around the corner there by Hackney. He might get it back still. Greenwood. Rusin did score twice for Sunderland's under-21 side. 13 goals with in the 22-23 season. Clark, caught by Ailing. Well, just about 35 minutes of football. Roberts. Not a bad ball there. Kielder was have to go to. Kielder was going to have to do something acrobatic there to force that one home. Probably a shade offside anyway. The flag did go up against him. Ball in by Silvera. Ailing. Silvera. 
bump into the back of Hackney there. Here is Hayden Hackney. Ballard awkwardly away. Kilda's header. Bellingham can't hold it. Now to play by Hjelda, who's had an up-and-down debut so far. Should be said that Middlesbrough do have a game. Former England under-21 international. Nelson getting stuck in there against Hjelda. Middlesbrough having to come again. Hjelda. Silvera, Rusin, who certainly made an impact. Lovely touch on here. Clark darting on the outside. It just needed a touch in. Clark saying, Well, I did my part. Equa. Rusin, Kielder, Equa. Can they finish the job here, Sunderland? Will be good enough for him, I'm sure. Has a problem. Means we will have a bit more additional time.